the Bible. All right, today is September 8th, 2021, and I'll read Ezekiel. I'll read Ezekiel chapter 38 in the Old Testament. One of the major prophets. There's major prophets and minor prophets in the Old Testament. I believe it's after the poetical books. I've been alternating from poetical books and major prophets. Ezekiel 38. Gog's alliance invades Israel. It's a lot. Of, this is shared a lot with end time teaching of Armageddon, Magog, and Gog. I won't go into that, but we'll just read this. Gog's alliance invades Israel. The word of Adonai came to me, saying, Son of man, set your face toward Gog, not God, Gog of the land of Magog, chief prince of Meshe and Tubal. Prophesy against him, and say, Thus says Adonai Elohim, Behold, I am against you, Gog, chief prince of Meshe and Tubal. I will turn you about and put hooks into your jaws. I will bring you out with all your army, horses and horsemen, all of them splendidly dressed, a vast assembly with breastplate and shield, all of them wielding swords. With them will be Persia, current day Iran, Kush, I believe current day Egypt, and put, we'll research on that, all of them with shield and helmet, Gomer and all his troops, the house of Togarma, from the extreme north of all his troops, and all his troops, many peoples with you. Be prepared, prepare yourself, you and your company gathered around you, be a guard for them. After many days, you will be summoned. In the latter years, you will come against the land that has been brought back from the sword and regathered from many peoples on the mountains of Israel, which had been a continual waste. But they were brought out from the peoples. When all of them are dwelling securely, you will come up, and you will come like a storm. You will be like a cloud covering the land, you and all your troops and many peoples with you. Thus says Adon, Adonai Elohim, Praise the Lord. It will come to pass in that day that things will come into your heart and you will devise an evil plan. You will say, I will go up against the land of unwalled villages. I will fall upon the quiet people who live securely and all of them living without walls having no of the chapter since I had some technical issues. I think I started saying, Thus says Adonai Elohim, I will come to pass in that day that things will come into your heart and you will devise an evil plan. You will say, I will go up against the land of unwielded, unwalled villages. I will fall upon the quiet people who live securely, all of them living without walls, having no bars or gates, in order to seize, spoil, and carry out plunder to turn your hand against the waste places now inhabited and against the people gathered from the nations who have been acquiring livestock and property who live in the center of the world. Sheba, Didan, and the merchants of Tarsus, with all its young lions, will say to you, Have you come to see spoil? Have you assembled your company to plunder, to carry away silver and gold, to take away livestock and property, to make off with immense spoils? Therefore, son of man, prophesy, say to Gog, Thus says Adonai Elohim, in that day when my people Israel dwell safely, will you not know? You will come from your place out of the extreme north, you and many peoples with you, all of them riding on horses, a great company and mighty army. You will come up against my people Israel like a cloud covering the land. It will happen in the last days. I will bring you against my land so that the nations may know me when I am sanctified through you, God, before their eyes. Thus says Adonai Elohim, Are you the one that I spoke about in former things 
through my servant the prophets of Israel who prophe prophesied in those days for many years that I will would bring you up against them. And that day when God comes against the land of Israel, it is a declaration of Adonai. My fury will rise up in my nostrils. In my jealousy and a fire of my wrath, I have spoken. Surely in that day there will be a great earthquake in the land of Israel. The fish of the sea, the birds of the heavens, and the beasts of the field. All creeping things that creep upon the ground and all the humans upon the face of the earth will shake at my presence. The mountains will be thrown down. The steep places will fall. Every wall will fall to the ground. I will call for a sword against him throughout all my mountains. It is a declaration of Adonai. Every man's sword will be against his brother. I will punish him with pestilence and blood. I will pour out rain on him, on his troops, and on the many peoples with him. A torrential rain with hailstones, fire and brimstone. So I will magnify and sanctify myself. I will make myself known in the eyes of many nations, and they will know that I am Adonai. That's 23 verses. In chapter 38 of Ezekiel, Gog's alliance invades Israel. Amen.